Now we'll have a quick look at the NTE hub. I believe they're updating this soon, but I want to show you the basics and using it anyway. Now this enables you to recall the lecture or meeting or anything you want and then upload it to your N hub. So before we start, go to settings bottom right hand corner and depending on the storage and the amount of time you've got remaining you can choose whether you want high, click OK or medium quality audio. You've got to select your audio format, it's only MP4. Now when you add a bookmark, you've got a couple of options here. You can open the camera to automatically take a snapshot, be it a slide while you're there, or maybe a blackboard, whiteboard, or you can choose open scribble pad where we can do a quick note. Last of all, you've got to device how much storage you've got. Now, top right hand corner to invert the color back and forth. And if you go to folders at the bottom, you can then add folders at the top by clicking plus. I'm going to add test and select add. Now I'm ready to go. Bottom left hand corner hit the record button. Now click the middle button to start recording. Give it a name so I'll call this test again and I'm going to put it in the university folder and select create. And you can see now as I talk it's now recording. Now here's the bookmark option so every time you click that you can separate slides or information. See the bookmark one now if I tap on the bookmark I can choose to add a colour. So then you can start colour coding your information and select done. While I'm here I could also add a note. So I could type a quick note and select add note. Also if you want you take a snapshot with the camera option. Select camera and then you take a snapshot. Use photo bottom right and then you organise your information by adding a note, colour coding the bookmark and add in an image, be it slide, white or blackboard. Select into here and there's your images as you build them up. Come back out of here, select back up top left and then you can add a second bookmark and carry on working on that. So bookmark 2. This time let's look scribble and you can do a quick note. And then you can change your colours and so on. Select confirm and then again if I go back top left hand corner you've now built up your information. Now when the lecture's finished, click the stop button and then click OK. Now I've got a few options here. If I click the middle button, it will upload to my end hub server. But you have to put in your details, same as your end hub. Or, or I can use this button here to send it via email or even maybe a cloud. If I click the middle button, give you the options here, UK server or US and put your username and password there and it'll automatically send your recordings to your end hub. Thanks for watching.